Hi folks, so we're going to take a look at number 11 from part 2 of the unit 3 assignment. So here uh, they give us these two equalities as a given and they want us to show that x is equal to 1 over 6. Alright, so first thing I notice about these two equations is they both contain logarithms but logarithms of different bases. Okay, and they also both contain an x. So my guess is we're going to have to in some way combine these equations that'll eventually give us an equation where we can solve for x and show that it's equal to 1 sixth. All right, so as soon as I see something like this, my first instinct is to use the change of base formula. So that's, I think, what I'm gonna try doing, see how that works. And I think this looks a little more complicated, so I think I'm gonna change the base on this one here. So change it from base B to base A. Okay, so I'll start with the second equation, and I'm gonna rewrite this in terms of base A. So what's the rule for that? Well, it's log base A of the original input, which is root A, divided by log base A of the original base, which is B. And of course, that's equal to 3x squared. Okay, so a couple of nice things I'm noticing, because if I look at the top, well, square root of A is just A to the 1 half. So log base A of A to the 1 half is just going to be one half, all right? And here, log base A of B, well, that's the other expression that was given to me. I know that log base A of B is equal to one over X. And all of a sudden, I've got something which is much nicer because I'm left with an equation that only has uh, the unknown X. Okay, so let's do a little simplifying here. So one half divided by one over X is the same as one half times X over one. So that's just gonna be X over two is equal to 3x squared, all right? Let me multiply the two to the other side. x is equal to 6x squared, and I end up with just a uh, quadratic equation. So let's bring the x to the other side, 6x squared minus x. Okay, factor out the x, 6x minus 1, and so I've got two possible answers here, x equals 0 or x equals 1 over 6. Now they're telling me that the answer should just be 1 over 6. So it's possible that x equals 0 is an extraneous root. So let's check that out because this does solve this polynomial equation. But when I go back up to uh, the original expressions and equations that I was given, I see right away there's a bit of a problem because here log base A of B is equal to 1 over x. I used this expression as part of my uh, solution. And of course, this is not defined for x equals zero. So we need to eliminate that answer. And so in the end, we're left with just x equals one over six. Okay, so just to recap, I needed to use this information, which required logarithms of different bases to solve an equation. And so my um, strategy was to change everything in terms of the same base. So I started with this one, turned it into base A, and luckily was able to do some nice uh, substitution uh, to allow me to solve an equation. But then of course, once I had my solutions, I noticed that one of them was not a valid one because of this one over X. Okay, that's it for this one.